Did you know that buying an expensive laptop for video editing is no longer necessary? In fact, you don't even need to install any applications in order to edit your videos. All you need is a stable internet connection and your favorite web browser. In this video, we'll show you how to edit a clip using only your web browser. We'll look at everything from importing to cutting and enhancing a video that you've either saved on your computer or have already shared online. We'll explore how to add b-roll, background music and sound effects as well as how you can create a video based on a script using AI text-to-speech technology. Let's begin by looking up Flixier. Flixier is a cloud-based video editor that lets you edit videos using powerful cloud servers rather than relying on your computer's resources. It offers a free version if you want to try it out, and the paid plan costs as little as a weekly coffee at Starbucks. That's a lot less than a video editing laptop, so depending on where you live, it can make editing videos pretty accessible. Once you're on the Flixier website, click on Get Started and you'll be presented with a number of import options. For this example, we'll use a clip we already have on our computer. After importing our clip into Flixier, let's Let's take a look at how we can enhance the quality of our video, since as content creators we often end up with clips that don't end up looking as good as we want them to. To address this, we'll go to the right side of the screen and open the Color tab. In the Color tab, you'll find a number of settings that allow you to enhance your video. Experiment with the saturation, contrast and vibrance sliders if you want to make your videos look a bit more lively and help them stand out. When you're satisfied with the way your video looks, you can move up to step 2. Cutting. Cuts are more than a way to get rid of mistakes and bad takes. They play a key role in visual storytelling and as you make your way throughout your video editing journey, you'll learn to choose the best cuts to serve your video's narrative. To cut a section of our video, we can scroll through the timeline and press the S key or click the cut button here in the left side of the screen. Make a cut at the start of the section that you want to get rid of and another cut at the end. Now right-click the portion that you want to cut and select Ripple Delete. This way, that portion of your video will disappear and the bits that were before and after the cut part will be brought together seamlessly. Now that you've seen how easy it is to cut a video, let's move on to the third step, adding B-roll. A video is always more engaging with context, so you can use B-roll to set the mood or just to add a little more context to something that you're explaining. Flixier makes adding B-roll a breeze. On the left side, you've got the Stock tab. We can look up some footage using the search bar at the top and after we find one or more clips that we like, we can add them to our video using this plus button or just drag them down to the timeline. We can also add fade in and fade out transitions by clicking on add transition in and out from the menu on the right. You're free to adjust the duration of each transition by dragging with the cursor on the timeline or by typing in the exact number of seconds on the right side of the screen. Now that we've got our B-roll, let's add some sound effect. Instead of trolling through various websites and having to create a dozen accounts in the process, we can just use Flixier. In the audio tab, you already have a variety of sound effects and music tracks which you can use in your video. Let's say you want to add some crickets in the background. We'll search for crickets, find the sound effect that we like and add it to the timeline. This tab is also where you can find background music for your video. Something to keep in mind is that all videos, music and sound effects that you can find in Flixier are royalty free so you can use them in your videos without having to worry about copyright issues. Another useful feature we haven't discussed yet is subtitles. After generating your subtitles, you can manually go through them to look for errors and customize them using Flixier's presets. If you want more control, you can also just customize them manually by changing the fonts, the size and the background colors all from the menu on the right side of the screen. You can burn these subtitles into your video or you can download them separately and upload them alongside your video to YouTube and other online video sharing platforms. Now that we've covered the basics, it's time to talk about something a little different. Generating voiceovers using text. Since we already have the script for this video, we can copy it and then go back to Flixier. Click on Import, select text-to-speech, paste your copied text, choose a language, which in our case is English, then select a neural voice and click on Import. Now we've got our voiceover magically generated and ready to go without having to record it ourselves. We can put together the rest of the video using clips and images we find in the Stock tab and use the Audio tab to get music and sound effects. As a finishing touch, let's add an animated button to remind viewers to like the video and subscribe to the channel. To do this, we'll go over to Motion, then Graphics and drag over the animation that we like best. As you can see, it's pretty easy to put videos together with Flixier. If you like what you saw, you can go over to Flixer.com to try it out for yourself. I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. Before I say goodbye, I recommend that you check out this clip where I show you how to create cool intros for your videos. It's a great way to get a better look at the more in-depth editing techniques available in Flixier. Until next time, happy editing!